We are here at the cafeteria it's at the hotel. Sweet. It's already sweet. It's made it more sweet. I just went put extra sweet there in my latte. What did you get? Cappuccino. You got a cappuccino. Well, maybe they're sweet with the cappuccino, not the latte. Why would they do that? They came from the same machine. Nope, it's perfect. <coughs> you so making it more sweet made it perfect? Yes, it did. This is my Mickey waffle sausage bacon hash brown I'm <coughs> dying an egg platter. And what did you get? Oh, the same Mickey. thing. Look how cute Mickey is. Yeah. <laughs> I gotta take a bite. This is our off day and the weather forecast says it's going to rain all day. So we plan to look around some hotels and check out Disney Springs and see the new Star Wars movie. So it's a pretty perfect day for that. All right? Yep. All right. Ooh, let's watch you. You're skill here. Do we have a skill shot? Can you hold it like four inches up and drop it? What? Can you hold it like high up in the air and you drop it down? Why? Because that's cool. Look at that. Why are you so weird? Get my food. We had breakfast. Get dressed. Oh, and we slept in this morning. To like, uh, I woke up at 9:30. Or 9:11. Sorry, the clock is wrong in the room. But still, 9:11. Like I haven't slept until 9 o'clock, and I don't know how long. And I was still ready to sleep some more. So it was pretty nice. Did you enjoy? I know. I purposefully flushed the toilet really loud so that way. You is that what woke me up? Yes, it is. See. Secrets of being married. That's where we, there's the food court, that's where we ordered our food. Oh, you're welcome. I just want to show you how far away our room is. It's quite ridiculous. Uh, but we're going this way. Our room? Our room is this way. Where, where are you going? Hey. You're almost going to the gift shop. I was following the people. <laughs> following the people? All right, so we ended up these doors. We got this awesome pool here. Take a look. And our hotel is that one, the giant shark fin. We have like a 30 foot walk. A little bit more than that, but. 30 feet. I realized that after I said it, maybe 30 meters to the shark fin, and then we go upstairs to our room. It's pretty perfect. Do you like our room? I don't think we've ever had a room this close to like the check-in front at the desk area. No, not even at, not even at uh, French Quarter, which well, was much, much, much Yeah, Port we were still like way out there. It wasn't way out there, but it was, it was a decent walk. This is, we are literally in the closest building, even the building over there is further away. We are in the closest building to the resort. And the only way it could get any easier is if we were on the first floor in one of these rooms over here. But honestly, we're on the second floor. It's just freaking awesome. We got these cool surfboards out front. I like it. We might walk around the resort on our last day but as of right now, I think we're just content with uh, walking to our room. <laughs> All right. Off for an adventure. Adventure is out there. Right? You say it. Say adventure is out there. Weird. What? You're so weird. Say, say it. Weird. I'll say it with you. Adventure is out there. And I'm weird. Alright, so we are here in Disney Springs and we have a mission today. What is that mission? You're bad. Hell, it's a necessity mission. Our bag just broke, so we are heading over to Uniglow and we're gonna see if we can find a new bag and any other Disney merch that we seem to like. I'm cool because I'm saying the word merch, right? That's what all the Disney people do. All the videos? Yeah. Yeah, that makes me cool. I don't know what Uniglow is. 
but we're going in. Look, they're all dancing. They're all dancing to the music. And spinning around. They don't want to look at me. They're shunning me. But, ah. Uh, it is like an H&M. He wasn't expecting a picture. That's not a bad price, $9.90 for sure. Look at this special. Disney. Looks like a uh, airport. Where they have the lettering and stuff done. And like the desk. This is pretty cool. Touch here to take four photos. Pick up your printed photos. Christian, can we touch here and take photos? Let's try. We just went and did our photo booth, and we get a free photo. We took four pictures, and we got our favorite one. And they're gonna print it for free. That's cool. What do you think? I feel like I should be dancing. Oh, and it's ready. Let's take a look at our photo. Whoa, that's cool, that's our favorite. That's a lovey-dovey one. That's what we're figuring out. And then the one in the corner is like, we're so, wait, we have to take a picture now? I like it. That's one for the, for the frame. All right. Up next, the world of Disney. This is my favorite store when I was little. I like all like, the displays and stuff in it. They are changing it though. It is a lot smaller than it used to be. And there's the Lego store. They got a cool dragon out there. I still like the store. It's got all the cool accessories and the roof and the lamp. Look at those lights. They crazy. Look at all these people. That's crazy. Antenna toppers. We're gonna get an antenna topper because we have an antenna now on our car. We just realized. Oh, that's a cute hat. It's like us, we love each other. The fanny pack. Pack for all of your needs. I can always get one of these. What? I could always get one of these. You could. You can wear it, they have it, so you can wear it like a bag too. I like that. Just hang, like that. That's a that's a potential. Wanna hold on to it? I can hold on to it for you. What else do we got here? We got style and make We got mini purse. <laughs> They've got it in cute size. And they got fun mini bags. So much stuff. We are here outside the Lego store. There's a dragon that's been in the water since I was a little kid. Rainforest Cafe in the background. The Starbucks. World of Disney. And then us. Oh, and those are the babies. I miss the babies. Oh, well, Chris, there's a phone stop. I want to show what we just traded for. It was amazing. We got all of these Epcot pins. I got a grape one. These are all brand new hidden Mickeys. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We did nine trades. Actually, there are more trades. We traded for these two. All in the World of Disney Store. So we've got most of the set for Epcot. I'm missing two from the fruit set. We just started collecting the Feet series, and I love the Dumbo one. And we got two from the teapot set, and one from the surfboard set. So we are on our way to collecting all of the new 2018 Hidden Mickeys. These are all real, authentic, brand new Disney pins. So I am a super pin excited. Pin sighted? I don't know, but I'm that. Where are we going next? I don't know. We'll see where the wind takes us.
We got a dinner reservation tonight at Narcoosie's. And we're gonna check out some hotels this afternoon. So, very exciting day. We are heading into Once Upon a Toy. Why might you ask? Well, if you see behind me, you'd know. Behind me is Pin Traders, where we did not get as lucky with pins as I would have liked. To infinity and beyond. We, uh, it's fun trading. But we're gonna go in here and search for more lanyards. Let's take a look. Look at all these plushes. Oh, I like Baymax. He's giving a hug. The Dumbos. Look, they have new Tsum Tsums out. They have Dapper Donald and Dapper Mickey and Dapper Minnie. I've never seen those. They got these old foofies. And Christian's already pin trading. You're so it's just starting to rain and we're going to head into the Earl of Sandwich and uh, we're going to get something to eat because we got all these quick services we got to use. I say it like it's a bad thing. Oh look at that, that looks delicious. Will mine look just like that? You said yes? Sure. Great. Let's do it. I think I'm going to get the original. Whatever that is. Yeah, looks good. I'm gonna do the original. Because you go to Earl Sandwich, you gotta get the classic, right? That's what I heard. We'll be inside eating while the storm is on. Look at Tinker Toys. My mind's so scattered. I'm like a 12 year old on medicine. Oh, wow. Apparently, everyone else had the idea to get Earl Sandwich along with us. We escaped the theme park, so I had to wait until another line. Is this the end of the line? I believe so. <laughs> uh, we're gonna go down here. That's a lot of dough. All right, so Kirsten just ordered us our food here at Earl of Sandwich, and it would've cost us $33, but it was two quick services. We got drinks, we got sandwiches, and we got sides. I got a brownie, Christian got potato salad, and we are waiting for the buzzer to go off. Rally number 314, and then we'll pick up our food. Here is the original Earl of Sandwich. Take a look. It's very hot. Oh, we got cheese. That's what I like to see right there. What'd you get? Turkey wrap. Oh, look at that wrap. That's a big wrap. Yes, it is. Very big. Look at the inside of that. That is delicious. That looks great. For a future reference, Shock Top is a beer. Not flavored, but it's still good. It's not bad. One of the better ones that I've had. How was it? You're not making a face like you like it. It's Share wonderful. my drink with me. I'll have it. How is it? Best turkey sandwich ever. I'll try this. It's very hot. I'll well, try it. Do I say it in my mouth? Oh, good. Very good. We're in Disney Trident. That's a lot of chandeliers. Did you see all those? That's adorable. I think you should get this. I'm not getting it. How much is it? $70. That's worth it. <laughs> totally worth it. Oh, you should get that too. And that. You should at least get the wallet. Oh. And I'll surprise you with it. Probably not. That's why I said probably not. I already told them probably not, but you weren't listening. Told who? <laughs> the camera. The future us that watches this. Because I knew I'd be in trouble. 
Oh, there's the Seven Dwarfs one from Monster Zane. When you, when you, uh, win the lottery, then we can get this. We have to, you can't win the lottery if you don't buy a ticket. Right? It's from a movie we watched with Jake Gyllenhaal. Gyllenhaal, y'all? Gyllenhaal. We secretly came in here looking for pins. Uh, we came in here. Dang it. But I see more pins. Our, just outside the Lego store, we have a massive Lego project underway. Look at this. Christian, come over here. Christian. Look. They're actually letting people make it. And then they're adding it to. They're doing a giant Millennium Falcon. That's what it is. You can see this here is the back of the blue lights. And up front over here is the uh, cockpit. Here are bricks that were built that they're adding. Let's see the interior. Here is the one sample. That's the blue. And this is what it will look like, I believe, when it's finished. And there it is. That is amazing. Christian, you want to build a brick? You got it. Do you want to build a brick to go on this Lego piece that's going to be here forever? It's not going to be here forever. Do you well, want to build a brick? Yes, I do want to build a brick. Oh. So come over here and build a brick with me. You're on the wrong side of the barrier. I like it. Sure, I'll build it. She'll go to the All right, so I finished it. This is my Lego brick that will go be immortalized as a Millennium Falcon piece. I'm going to go turn it in and get my Certificate of Achievement. Yes, nice. trying to get that in. Awesome. Here's your boundary. Get your certificate right over by the awesome. yellow banner. Thank you. All right, now I get a certificate for turning this in. I don't know where I am. All right, it looks pretty good. I went into a tub. They're going to use my piece that I built in that giant statue of the Millennium Falcon. It's going to be awesome. All right, I think I'm going to head on in and get my certificate of achievement. Hey, we're going to see this thing. Is your bind here? Probably. Probably. Look at this giant hole. I didn't help build him, but I'm sure somebody did. And so I take my voucher somewhere in here to the yellow banner. I am in line get my Lego certificate saying that I built this thing. Shows for participating in an official Lego building event in recognition of the enthusiasm and creativity displayed in building with Lego bricks. Hell yeah! I've got my box of bricks. My brick is in that box right there. Could be in his hand right this very moment. Now it's part of this Millennium Falcon Forever. I helped build this Lego statue. It's free labor. It's uh, pretty amazing. Yeah, it is. It's a Super smart idea. You have a couple cars, you make a design that's pretty simple. You break it into small little chunks and then you let the masses build it. They have that community involvement and then boom, you got yourself an amazing new Lego statue. And I want to come back and visit it and say, yeah, see that Millennium Falcon? I helped build that. I had one two by four brick part of it. Two by four. Two by four by four, yeah. It's a rectangle brick. Yeah, look at these balloons. Just look at them. Temporary Resort, a Disney Vacation Club Resort. That's why it's so expensive. It's for DVC members. I like it.
Magic Kingdom car and bus parking. To the right is Disney created Seven Seas Lagoon. To the left is Bay Lake. Nestled on the shores of Bay Lake are Disney's Fort Wilderness Resort and Campground. We're down this cool big stairs here. This place is amazing. I feel like we're like in a castle. Super fancy. The windows, the chandeliers. almost a tiny top of the building. I believe that's where we're going. And that's where Narcusis is for dinner tonight. Look at this hotel. You said this might be your new favorite. It's beautiful and it's blocked by these trees but we'll come around this way. And back there, I can start to see it, is the castle. And there's a monorail coming out. Across the street is a contemporary. I'm gonna walk this way so you, so you, so I can see the castle whenever you watch this. But there it is, right back there. Just up in there. Ah. Oh. Imagine waking up and having that castle be your view every day, or having a room that looks out to it. It'd be incredible. But now, we're gonna go feast at a signature dining restaurant, Narcusi's which we know nothing about because no one's supposed to say anything about it and hope that it's the most amazing meal we've ever had. I don't know, we've had a couple good ones so far so this is going to have to... This is a tough competition. There it is, Narcusis. Out there is Space Mountain and Magic Kingdom. Here is my beautiful wife. There's a cool mural. Some table with the magic Mickey sparkles. Our menu. And more importantly, the drink menu. This is my fancy drink. Christian got the same one, how is it? It's very good. I'm gonna try it. Yeah, it's really good. It's our massive bread loaf that we got. It's only half. <laughs> and they got these fancy butters. I think it's salt on the top of the butter. Is it salt? It's, I think it's salt. It's really good. Look at the mass of that. Yeah, it's salt. <laughs> Buttering that up. Pink salt or whatever. Look at these amazing, like, color changing glasses. That is cute. It's fancy. <laughs> Your head's in the glass. Alright, we ordered our food. Christian got the serve and turf, and I got the filet mignon. So far, in our fusies. Outstanding. So this is my filet mignon. It looks delicious. My drink. And Christian got the surf and turf with the steak. I hope that's delicious. Want to Um, I eat first. I don't. Yeah, dip in the butter.
Hey, that's the shot. How is it? Good. Bam! And that's a candy bar. It looks like it slid all the way across the plate. That's, I already ate some of mine. That's super, you already ate some of yours? I ate my loop -a loop Your what? My loop -a loop You ate the loop the loop Yeah. I can't even show what the loop the loop looks like. You're not even supposed to be videoing. I can video. It's legal. Was it good? You could use that to stab it into the cheesecake and pick the cheesecake up with it. Like a it's stabber not for that. it. It's not that strong. Right, right oh, okay. Well, I'm gonna eat mine. I don't look, there's little bubbles in there. There's thingies in there, there's little balls inside my candy bar. What? There's balls in my candy bar. Yeah, they're good. So, we just found out that there was a celebrity sitting next to us. Celebrity? Well, he's from The Diz, which is a YouTube channel, sitting right next to us, the very next seat, on his one-year anniversary dinner, here at the Grand Florian Narcissus. <laughs> oh, look how pretty this is. This is amazing. And that that's the secret reason why I shouldn't have been filming it. Because I secretly got hit my camera. Maybe. We'll have to check the footage. Check tape. Right now. Alright, either I did get him or I didn't get him. But we'll, but we'll know. Alright. Look how awesome this is. So what are we doing when we go inside? What's our quest? Look around. Check the shops. Maybe get a bracelet from Pandora. And uh, it says shop. And maybe uh, do some pin trading. We'll see what the night holds. We just entered the Polynesian. Look down. And over here is Kona Island. Christian, remember that video we watched when they said their favorite thing to do was to come and get coffee at Kona Island? Can we can we get coffee at Kona Island? Is there a non-coffee drink here again? Maybe next time. But there it is. Kona Island. That's pretty cool. I've only seen this in videos. And here is the merchandise. This place is pretty cool. Oh look, they have Moana Mercantile. That's probably new since the movie. Alright, let's go search for pins. There's lots of stitch everywhere. Look at all the stitch. Oh, it's because the stitch is like Polynesian. I understand. I think so too. This one's nice. There's a big boutique down there. In the corner. Probably more fun for the kids, yeah. But I think the other one's prettier. We're gonna head to Trader Sam's and get some drinks and celebrate. What? Of course we can. No, we can. Like, not cool or no. It's not like it's a weekend. The pineapple on. Oh, and I see a pin board. Trader Sam's had quite a long wait, so I think we're gonna hang out outside and maybe get a drink outside and enjoy the sunset. Complete with a picturesque backdrop of Cinderella Castle. We are now stopping at Disney's Grand Floridian Resort and Spa, a Victorian style hotel offering the modern conveniences of a full service. And you can kind of see. It's Yep, that pavilion there is Darkusi's, and over there to the left 
uh, is the water pageant going on. It's pretty cool. In the far distance, there's fireworks. Yes. You can kind of barely see them on here. The water pageants are I've never even seen the water pageant. I, don't think. I haven't seen this water pageant either. This is for like the hotels. Looks like King Triton is pushing on uh, a bunch of seahorses. Yeah, there's an alligator. Uh, looks like a brontosaurus. Or a Loch Ness. I don't know, that's really cool. So much stuff always going on.